Hello, this is Tom and in this video I want to show you how to use the unofficial joystick plug-in for Unreal Engine 4. You can get the Unreal Engine 4 plug-in sources from this GitHub website. First step, get the sources. First, if you clone for the engine release of 4.12, you have to use the, the branch 4.12. If you use engine release 4.11, 10 or something else, then you have the vice versa branch. Clone the Git repository and chain, uh, change the branch with the checkout. If you have not done before, then create with your Unreal Engine the editor version and project or folder. Copy in this project folder the plugins directory from the cloned joystick plugin. In the directory for third party sources and SDL2, call the setup batch file to clone the SDL sources via the Mercurial client. If you have done that, call the build batch file. This compiles the library and DLLs for the plugin. And at last copies the resulting DLLs and libraries to correct places. Third step, the plugin itself. Call via the Explorer Write button, generate Visual Studio project files. This will uh, create a project file where the joystick plugin is included. Open with the Unreal 4 editor your project file. This should be go right. Go to the settings panel and plugins menu part. Check if the joystick plugin in the input controller section is enabled. Then to configure the joystick, go to the project settings input and map your actions to the connected joysticks. Only connected joysticks will appear in the list of possibilities for mapping. Fails could happen uh, while generating the joystick plugin. First fail, no source codes. If you get this, this dialog from the editor so, well, while uh, starting the editor with your project file, then uh, your project has no C++ sources. Solution. Your project has no C++ source files, so you have to create someone, some. Remove the joystick plugin from the project, open the project again without the joystick plug-in and create via the menu point add C++ class an empty or non class to your project. If the editor and the compiler is done, close your projects. Then you can go to the third step. Third step, again, generate Visual Studio project files, open the project, go to settings plugin, check if the joystick plugin is enabled, go to the project settings input and map your actions to the connected joysticks. Fail 2, the plugin binaries were not compatible with your engine. This sometimes happens if uh, you have a newer version or you compiled it on your own. Then the solution is easy. Go to the Visual Studio project, use the Unreal VS plug uh, wizard for Visual Studio and recreate all the uh, sources and compile it. Third fail. Sometimes if you want to deploy your game, you get this. 
And this says that the SDL sources and for deploying very important the static library of SDL2 is not existing. So SDL sources doesn't not does not exist at all. The solution is go to second step. In the third party SDL2 directory you have the batch file, set up batch. This is cloning with via Mercurial client uh, sources for SDL and build batch will compile it. Some points. Default binaries in the GitHub I deliver are only for 64 bit. There is no activation or mapping uh, to do if you want to use the plugin. The only way is via the action mapping. So there is no special handling in the blueprints. The Linux version works, but only if you have the plugin placed in the engine sources itself and compile the whole engine with the plugin included. So now I try to follow my own instructions to get a compiled plugin and usable plugin. First, I have to clone the repository. Hmm. I had already done it. This is the directory where I had the, cl the clone placed. As you can see, this is the original version. Um, now I have to create a project file so I couldn't use the my normal projects I had already done a ver version but we want to start at the beginning so I have to start the editor I use the 4.12 version and as it starts you can see I chose a new project. I chose the vehicle because it's good to show the test uh, joystick in this case for a video. Names are always complicated so uh, I use an blueprint only version, not a C++ version, to get and to force the fail happens in this case. This takes a moment. Okay, this is the engine and if I go to the Plugins menu, you can see there are no input uh, controller devices or something else, which is uh, something like joystick. And if we go in the input sections, we can see in the action mappings, if I add some here is no joystick at all, only default variants. So I close this and now I will copy the plugin directory to the project file. Uh, test joystick video. Here I have to place it. I have to generate the Visual Studio project file because the Visual Studio project file uh, in this moment has no information about the plug-in. So I have to generate a project. Now I get this error. And if you view the fails video part, then I had a solution for this. The solution was delete the plugin directory, open the test joystick project again,
and add a new C++ class. Type none. This is an empty C++ class. Okay, create. And now it will create a Visual Studio project file with this C++ code because now it is compiling the game DLL. This, ta this takes a moment and uh, if we are done with that, we are, can close Editor and Visual Studio. Mm, I couldn't say how long it takes. So, this is done. The Visual Studio is loading. Uh, here it is. You can see the engine, the game, the test video, and no plugin. This is uh, what we want to achieve. So close, you can save it. Close the editor. Sometime Visual Studio takes a little bit. Now I want to copy Speed, plug in again. Okay, and now I could create a Visual Studio project file. And ready, starting. The splash screen is on the other monitor. So now we check if the plugin has an input controller and the joystick plugin is enabled. All correct. Now we could go to the input section and could assign a joystick. In this case I have plugged in an X52 Pro joystick. I select an X for forward and I know axes have to reverse and now right and uh, da, 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 no this is right okay and I start and now you have to believe me that I pull the joystick and I could drive with uh, the joystick So how it works? Only via the action mapping, because I have no change on the blueprints.